Catch on confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars. A successful landing for NASA's Mars rover Perseverance Thursday. The robotic astrobiology lab sharing this first image from the red planet moments after touchdown. Oh my God. Oh. A sigh of relief and of course cheers from scientists. <laughs> after the six-wheeled SUV-sized rover survived the last stretch of its journey. The most challenging thing is entering the Mars atmosphere. Mars atmosphere is very thin. It's about 1% of Earth's atmosphere, so it's just enough atmosphere that we get really hot coming in, but not enough atmosphere to slow us down, so very challenging. Dr. Lori Glaze, the director of NASA's Planetary Science Division, says the goal of the rover's two-year, $2.7 billion mission is to search for signs of organisms that may have thrived on Mars billions of years ago. We're going specifically to a landing site where we think that if life were present on Mars, this is where it would be preserved and our best chance of being able to, to see life if it were there. Got our second image in. It's also hoped the project will pave the way for future human explorations on Mars. A special experiment called MOXIE, which is the Mars Oxygen in situ Resource Utilization Experiment, which is a big mouthful. It's going to turn the carbon dioxide that's in the atmosphere into breathable oxygen. If we ever want to send uh, humans to Mars, uh, it would be great to be able to take advantage of the the oxygen that's contained in the carbon dioxide as opposed to carrying it with us. And part of the rover's job on Mars is to collect samples. There are a couple of missions planned in the years ahead to pick up those samples and bring them back here to Earth to study. Melissa Duggan, City News.